Hello everyone, how's it going? Doctor Incompetent here, and let's play some Satisfactory, shall we? Alright, well look at all these screws coming in. We have a side hustle over here. An entirely new site that we've built where we are doing our best. Ooh, I jumped up on the top. Or no, I missed it. To make more screws. And I'm going to make even more screws or try to, so I need them. Oh, right, right, right. Let me see my inventory. Alright, so I need to make sure I have enough. I have enough of these, but let me get some more uh, reinforced iron plates, plus I need a miner, a portable miner, to get through that node. Actually, let me just uh, swap this down here. We have a slight problem with this tree. It's just in the way. And I know it does nothing to impede the progress of my ramp there, my conveyor, but hey, I'm getting it out of the way. I'm clearing some space. All right, so I'm going to curl around here, and we need to pick up a portable miner, of which we have many. And in the meantime, I can say, hey, do you have any screws? And it's like, yeah, I got like, a couple. Um, and we can then use some of these screws to pop in here and, and keep this thing thriving. Okay. So now we have some more rotors, sort of. And, oh, look at that. We're two away. That's exciting. Uh, actually, well, let's just make, make them here then. I can make screws to make rotors. I now have enough for one rotor. Two. It's funny, it's like, if I do it like this, if it's, you know, a higher end item and I have the pieces, then it's not that hard to make rotors, but to make screws and make everything all the way up, it takes Milestone forever. Reached. Several buildings aimed at factory traversal can now be accessed in the build menu. Caution is recommended during use of these products. Products. Alright, so if I wanted to build uh, transportation, for example, a jump pad or a jelly pad, I would need um, rotors. Oh, look at all the bi- it takes 200 biomass to make a U-Jelly landing pad. Interesting. Oh, the funny thing about that is I think I don't have any biomass because I turned it all into biofuel. So I'm going to have to stop it at some point at the source so that I can have some. But there might not even be any... Yeah, there's none at the moment being made. I wonder if you can toggle production off you know like flip off a conveyor belt so that it will just stop for a moment so I can stop some something in the chain of production uh, but I don't know don't really know the answer to that all right and then we're going to make some reinforced iron plates but we can't because well we're missing screws ah uh, screws all right now I can. Beautiful. And I want to check what's the next um, milestone. It is resource sink. Okay. And we're going to select it. Uh, but the pod is launching, so we got to wait for that. Uh, okay, so while that's doing that thing... Let me run over here and uh, get into the business of fixing up this line, adding a new miner. Uh huh. Right there. And then what we're going to add is a. Uh, we need a smelter, actually. Uh-huh. And I'll just kind of put this one over there. 
And then we need a constructor, which can be... Oh, no, that was the right thing. I meant to just rotate it, not not do that. All right. And I could try to, you know, get it on this conveyor belt here. And I think what I'll do is I'll just build it like this, actually, and just put it out later instead of trying to, you know, in the short term make this all connect. And then... Okay, cool, yeah, you, you guys were telling me a lot of the key commands, so E quick switches, right? But what I want to do is just make a... Uh, a merger that targets this but I need it to go yes this way oh boy um, that is it and then I will just pull this to here fantastic and how many power poles do I have Chillin'. I got this one. Beautiful. Let me just build another pole over here. And let the magic happen. Alright, now it very well might wreck everything here, but all right, we need to set the recipe for iron. And we need to set the recipe over here for screws. Alright. Oh no! This is supposed to be rods. Whoops. There you go. Alright. Yep, I forgot one piece in the uh, line. Yep, and the fuse broke. Okay. So... That is totally okay. That just means I need a separate um, burner for this. So what I'm going to do is just basically uh, take this off. All right. And not connect it. This will be a separate entity. And we need another uh, constructor that will go right here along this line. Now I think that'll work. Good. Okay. Now um, what I need to do is this has 2F4. It's going to connect to this. And then I'm going to connect this to its own pole. And then we're going to run this baby all the way up to another biomass burner, its own thing. It's the easiest way for me to do things right now with these biomass burners that don't make that much electricity. Is to basically just say, okay... Um... You know, wire is too long. Oh, okay. Okay, so this line was too long, but now we can connect it and make our own connection there. And what I'm going to do is then make a biomass burner. Oh, here, I guess. There you go. And then... There. Okay, fantastic. And then we just need to uh, interact with this and just give it some fuel, which we have. Okay, and then turn it on. And then another one of these 
blew out. Which one was that? Well, somebody blew out, right? You. There. Okay, hopefully we're good. Now let's see. Let's watch from a vantage point. Oh no. This is making rods, but it's not making screws. This isn't, right? Oh no. You're supposed to make screws. This isn't connected. It's it's because it's not connected. All right. Um I thought it was connected. I need to redo it. It looked like it was connected. Now let's see if this thing can spit out screws. Come on, there they go. All right. Okay. Now we got a ton of screws coming in. This is almost good. You know what I need to do is just go and uh, build another ramp. That is. Hmm. You know, right down here. There you go. It clips, you know, obviously, but it doesn't. Player is in the way, huh? Okay, now I can just not miss that jump. All right. So now, if I run all the way over here, I should find a ton of screws in here, and I do. I find it's decent amount. Okay, good. Now, let's talk about what we need here. We need um, wire. We need rods. We need plates. All right. And what we need, concrete? Okay. Actually, this is easy. We can do this one in a heartbeat. There you go. Cool. Milestone reached. You have been given early access to the anti-waste effort for stress testing of materials on Exoplanet. Stress testing. Funneling parts into the awesome resource sink, depending on their amount and complexity, will grant you coupons in the awesome store, which can be exchanged for bonus rewards. That's what I need to do to get those coupons. Examples of bonus content are Parts, walls, factory attachments, and cosmetics. Fix it is working hard to develop additional options, which will be added to the awesome store in the future. Go that extra kilometer. Go awesome. That's what we're doing. We're trying to go awesome. Uh, I'm going to put motors in this storage container. I don't really know. Man, this storage container is filling up, though. Oh, I guess that's why I have a storage box. I do have some leaves, so I can make some of the biomass that it needs. And then what I can do is just say to this guy um, not to actually make anything. No, no, you make it into this. But then when you get here, we just um, put it on standby. And then this should allow us to collect the resource that we need to make the jump pads and such. Pod launch. Uh, select milestone. Okay, we finished it. That is pretty cool. All right. So now um, we have a good amount of screws and concrete coming in. I would say 
my next order of business is getting a assembler hooked up to just make reinforced iron plates all day which would be this um yeah I can make some rotors that's fine go ahead maybe I make just put another one of these over here how much power does this have now it uses it all doesn't it depending on what's happening alright Mm hmm then um, what I could do is you are a constructor right and you go in there just in case I could just build another uh, biomass burner here all right and then we could start building uh, some more foundations over here and I can kind of just put a de facto assembler line in. If I need one. So it would look like this. It would be a assembler that was connected to a storage box that was connected to um, a storage box, <laughs> basically. So actually I need to I need to fill this out. Uh-huh. Alright, perfect. So we will have uh, a storage container that kinda sits there. And then we will have a assembler that you know tries to sit right by this, if at all possible. Can't afford, right. Well, I'm missing the very thing that I want to assemble. The irony. All right. And to do this, we need screws. That should be good. And so we have this. We need a assembler that will kind of sit. Oh, I need rotors. Oh, God. I'm falling to pieces. I got to check. I keep thinking I just, you know, have the stuff on me, but I, I don't. I have rotors over here, though. There's some rotors. Look at all those screws. Happy day. Okay. Now can I build an assembler? Yes. Encroaching somebody's clearance. Whose clearance? Alright, well. What about then? Can you build it, like, here? And can this connect to this guy? Yes. Oh, that's right. It's got to connect to two of these. Right, right. Interesting. Okay. And then we will make a place for the stuff to go right out here. short fit into this and then we will make one more over here hopefully this is no problem perfect okay so now um, all I have to do is build a power pole right here and connect it to our new biomass burner that we've built here and connect this to this open up this okay and let's get our ingredients
Do do do. Alright, so we need fuel. We need plates. I'm gonna take all the plates to their here, actually. And I'm gonna take all the screws to their here. And this should be good. Again, we're gonna be short on screws. Wherever we go, we have a problem, and it's screws. Okay, good. There. Mm -hmm. And then now, I just need to put that in, and this should start churning out at some point reinforced iron plates. Let's watch it happen. Let's watch the magic. There it goes. It's making it right there. Come on, plates. Something's happening. There they go. Perfect. So now we have plates. Uh, let's see how this is doing. It's got 27 biomass that we made with those leaves, so we just need some more leaves uh, to finish the 200 biomass to make one little jump pad, just for fun. Excellent. All right, so hopefully this screws operation will start filling up at some point. It's just going to take a while. I might not be able to connect it to my concrete. It might just be taking too long, you know, given... Um, given that I need both of them. Interesting. So, I think that I cannot merge my screw line with the cement. It just slows everything down too much. It's too much going in on one. Uh, so, what I'm going to have to do is build another dedicated line that arrives that merges, but, but later on the track, you know? And so I thought to myself, well, maybe it would be a fun time to just practice building a vertical. So let's try it. So instead of having this right here, what I can do is go into logistics and I can go for a stackable conveyor pole and I can um, oh boy, rotate this, right, so that it's over top of the existing conveyor, yeah, that, and then instead of merging this here, um, I'm going to take out the merger, and I'm going to uh, edit this to, I wish I could just do that and then do this. Ah, it doesn't quite work the, the way I dreamed it. Okay, but that's okay. We can shoot this into here. Um. Why can't you go in to here? Just connect with this. What? What's your problem? Connect here. I'm serious. Uh, go in here. What are you doing? You can't? Okay, here, try this instead. I have to have it coming out. Interesting. There you go. No, that's not the right way. Huh. It must be because it's going the wrong direction. Alright, so in tra instead try this. Come out. Uh-huh. And then hit this. The conveyor belt is too steep. What in God's name are you talking about? It's too steep. Get real. Just do that, then. Alright, there you go. Mm -hmm. Now 
now what I want to do is uh, I'm just running it along here for for fun but now another conveyor pole go back to the uh, stackable yeah Huh? And then I'm just going to kind of actually have it go over here. And let's see how this goes. Okay, so I want to build a lift. I'm going to try to build lift too. I know I don't need to build one that's this involved, but I'm going to. And I click it, and then I can raise it. And everybody was telling me about this, and I can rotate it. Oh, but it's going to take too many resources if I want to build it really, really high. I gotcha. So I don't have the resources. Well, then let's just build a regular lift. Uh, we'll build it right here. Uh, now we're going to connect it, please. Is that supposed to be connected? I'll pretend like it is. There we go. All right, it is connected. And we're going to carry this over. A -do -do -do. All right, fantastic. Great. And then I guess my goal would just be to... get this up here... And then I think it's unreasonable to try to share this storage facility with the concrete. Because it's going to require a merger that is going to slow it down. So instead, let's just put this right here. Snap it on the end if we can. Uh, I really just want to kind of snap it on the end of this guy. Can you line that up? How is that? Let's see if that builds right. Almost. And there it goes. And now screws are coming in. And I've got like a lineup where you can see that I have a conveyor belt over top of my lower conveyor belt. And that's awesome. Uh, but it's also hard to actually get through. That's interesting. I didn't even think about that. But anyway. Um, okay. Now that's a lot of screws. And again, it's too many screws. I think the merger is not doing well for me. I should probably make a separate <laughs> vehicle just for this, but that's where we're at. Now what I can do is I can go here and I can just say, how many screws do you have on hand? You have a ton. You also have a ton. So there was a backlog of a bunch of screws. And that's great. Okay. So now my plan is to go check on the screws. I have it a good amount and let's also see what the next you know level requirement is and see about these stickers so you see my cement is coming in really slowly unfortunately so I'll have
have to mess with that. Okay, so this says... Oh, I have to complete the space elevator phase one. Yikes. Alright, let me see what that's going to take. Um, oh, it's in here, huh? Oh. Special. Space elevator. And I can make the awesome sink and the awesome shop. Okay, cool. Uh, the space elevator is actually not that hard to build. So we can get that together. So you need a bunch of wire. Alright, what else do you need for this? Oh, you know what? I'm going to pin it. There we go. So I need uh, iron rods. I've got iron rods, or I should... I've got plates, I've got wire, and now it's just up to concrete. Am I out of power somewhere? Did I lose? Let me make sure all my stuff has power. Looks good. Looks good. Looks okay. That's yellow sometimes. But anyway, let's check on the concrete situation. I need more. But I have a bunch of limestone. So one thing I can always do is uh, put concrete over here in this bin. And I can just change this recipe to uh, concrete and then throw in limestone just get that processing oh boy hi funny I'm going to build another concrete production line The awesome sink is pretty easy to build. I just need uh, a bunch of plates, which I should have some over here. Is this my new plate operation? Now those are just regular plates. Where's my, didn't I build one where I was making reinforced plates? Yeah. Great. Alright. I need one more concrete and I'll get there. There it is. Alright, we can build the space elevator. I don't really know where to build this, but I'll build it nearby. Yeah, sure. That's hilarious. It's enormous. Look at me throwing all my materials onto it. That's sweet. I'm just like throwing ingredients at it, and it builds up in the air like that. Okay. Sure. We just built the foundation of a space elevator. So I assume this is so I can ship resources off-world. My god, that's a scary device. Alright. Uh, complete phase one, okay. Oh my. There it goes. And... That is a space elevator. There it is. It feels good to know that I made that. By hand. Instantly. Alright. Um, space elevator. It needs... Smart plating. Okay. 
Space Elevator Resource Delivery 1, Project Assembly Platform. Delivery will unlock Tier 3 and Tier 4. Okay, so it needs 50 of these smart plating, which I make in an assembly using two of my most complicated things to make. Okay, perfect. Well, we can do that, but that's going to be down the road. All right, then let's instead build the awesome sink, which we can build right away. And I don't know why, but I've kind of been building some of these things just here, you know? Uh, let me build some platforms over here. Oh, I don't have any concrete. My god, man, that's right. I used all my concrete on my space elevator. Just my teeny little space elevator here. Okay, no problem. Do I have any more concrete? Yeah, I got some. Not a bunch, though. You know what? Um, I will build the awesome sink. And I can build it oh, right here. It's fine for now. Always just deconstruct it if it's... Oh, man, it's huge. Never mind. Let's build it over here. Uh-oh, wait, it needs inputs and stuff? Can't afford. Oh, I need more concrete. Good lord. Yeah, all right, then let's just not build the awesome sink, and let's get real about more concrete. I know I saw more limestone down here, so it's going to be my job to acquire it. I'm going to need to get a portable miner, or build one. Just build a few, and take them with me. Uh-huh. So, uh, I need, oh my, I'm really running low, embarrassed. I used an extraordinary amount of stuff to put that together, so you'll have that. All right, portable miner, one. Two is good for now. Okay. And let me just head over here and start this concrete operation. I might have, like, overcorrected on screws, and, you know, I need more rods instead of screws. You know, the ratio is a little off, but to be honest. I don't think I can have too many screws. I think what I'm going to do... Um, well, first of all, let me reconfigure this to look for uh, limestone. I know I saw one over here. Really close by. Now, that's one that already exists. No, I didn't see one super close by. Hi. Thanks. Okay. Uh, I, I thought I did. That was a, a dream I had. It was probably one of those nodes that, like, you can't gather. Oh, what's this? Oh, my God. Look in here. There's, like, a little cave. I can't gather that for some reason. It's not... It's not something. All right, what's in this cave? What's this? Oh my god, what is this resource? Oh, it's leaves. Oh, oh, that's death spider. Uh-oh, run. Run. We've got death spider on us. This was not a good idea. Abandoned ship. Alien organs. Gross. All right, well... I don't think I'm ready for that. I'm looking for limestone. Uh, boy. Man, I was wrong. It's not as close as I thought. It was all iron. This is going to be quite the doozy to get to. Okay, well, 
appears to be almost like a road over here. Okay, is this it? That guy was difficult. Alright, so we're going to have to go into our inventory and just select this for now. Eat, restore our health a bit. And then go back into our inventory and uh, select this. And then this is a pure limestone. So I'm going to build a miner right here. That shoots it out. Where do you shoot it out? Yeah, other side, please. There you go. And then from here, what do we need? We need a... Uh, I really just need a constructor, don't I? Actually, um, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to build the, the higher quality. I'm going to push E and build the Mark II over here. Get a really, really nice one going. And then this is going to be making us just concrete forever. And then we can use Mark 1 to get us home. But in the meantime, we're going to need a power pole over here that connects um, that and that. And we will take this home. I'll probably have to build a few poles along the way. Let's see how far we can get this. That's good. Oh, I hurt myself. I fell so far. Yeah, I definitely need to jump, like the jump pads and stuff at this point. Just do this. Uh oh. I don't know if I can make it up this way. I might have to go the long way. Ah, this is cool. Well, we've got screws. That's not a question. Okay. Oh, this comes back by my one of my old iron locations. All right, let's get this built up here. Let's figure out as close as we can to build it. Here we go. Perfect. And then we're going to bring this back in. I am not going to connect it to anything. I'm going to build it, its own biomass burner, most likely. Wire is too long. Wow. Alright. Well, you tell me. Okay. And then... Uh, let's just put it, you know, right here for now. And then let me see, how good are you doing? You actually might be able to support this. This is going to be a pretty low-key setup. How good are you doing now? Max consumption is 26. Okay. Okay. Hmm. All right. So now we need to go into the business of like trying to build a conveyor that will bring us all this concrete. It, it will not be super easy, but we'll get there. 
This is so funny. I have this power line that's like stretching all the way. And I have this factory that's pretty far away. Whoa, look at that waterfall. I found an alien cave over here, which seems not trustworthy. Not safe. There's some kind of thing on the ledge over there. No idea what that is. Awesome. Everything is fine. Nothing to worry about. Okay. And then now we can start building our way home. And we're building Mark 1. Here it comes, and here we go. I'm gonna run out of uh, rods. Interesting. Too long. Okay. And let's just get it over here and uh, throw up a lift. Uh-oh, you better not come at me. This guy's coming at me. You're gonna get blocked by my wall. That's what's gonna happen to you. You're going to be embarrassed by my wall. Okay. And then I'm going to go into my build screen. Oh, here comes this guy. All right. Why do you insist on fighting me? Man, you are hard to kill. There you go. What do you got? Alien organs? Thanks. All right. And then we're going to go for a lift. That will connect here. And go up really really high like that yep and turn around that looks good sure and let's see what's happening am I getting any concrete coming there it comes look how beautiful that is here comes the concrete all right can I beat it home we're gonna race it honestly the jump pad and stuff would be really great the problem is it requires so much, you know, biomass. I'm going to have to go around chainsawing everywhere to get that set up. I am gathering a bunch of leaves, though, in this, you know, mad dash. All right. Uh-oh. Big friendly guy. Big friendly giant. Alright. Get this. Okay. So what's my goal? My goal is to find my lift. And connect to it. Let's see if we can target it from way over here. God, I hope so. I can. Amazing. Yes. Here it comes. Uh-huh. A player is in the way. You mean me. I'm in the way. Uh-huh. Just gonna try to snake this under here. Under here. Uh-huh. All the way home. Honestly, I could just connect it to one of... Well, these will start feeding it automatically, which we don't want. Oh, I'm running out of what? Concrete? Alright, cool. We can do that. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This game just gets more and more ridiculous. There's concrete. Um, oh, but it's stuck here, isn't it? Um, okay. No problem. I forgot that it would do this. 
Uh, give me all this concrete. And then... Uh, where do I see, like, the stuff that you have? It doesn't even go in there, does it? I wonder how I get this off of here. You know what I mean? Like, sometimes it'll let me target the concrete. And that's fine, right? But my curiosity is... Where is that concrete? Like, where does it exist? And is there any that got stuck inside this machine? I don't know. I don't know. Alright. Anyway, we now should have enough concrete to bring this home. You, I'm actually going to beat it. It takes so long with this conveyor belt, you know, for things to get there that uh, I'm going to beat it home. Can't afford. Oh, I'm still out of concrete, huh? Oh, no, this is out of... Uh, what am I missing? Iron plates and rods? Okay, let's go get it. What would be nifty is if I could connect it to my other concrete collection bin, which is here. But now that doesn't seem plausible at all. I do have some plates, though. And then... Uh, what are you making? Oh, you know what we need? Our, uh... Now, rotors are fine. We need a bunch of rotors, I guess. Um, but you need screws. Here you go. Have a bunch. And how are we doing our rods? Not that great. A lot of screws. I'm going to build a separate operation just for rods at some point. Okay. And here's our concrete. And I'm just going to kind of bring it down uh, to right. Mm. What you want to do is build the build this first. And then see if I can connect this up there. There we go. And we got it. Awesome. So now I have a side concrete hustle going. Like I said, this is extremely haphazard, but I'm really just experimenting and having fun. And, okay, so now we have screws, concrete, and plates pretty well taken care of. Now it's time to go back and do rods. Did you run out of power? You did. Luckily, our biomass is actually in decent shape, but we're probably going to go need to do a chainsaw run at some point. Um, was it the base that ran out of power? Is that what happened? Looks like it. Let's go ahead and get this going. There you go. How's your fuel situation? Not good. I'm actually going to take this biomass because I need it for jump pads. And I'm going to just give you the good stuff. For now. And... There you go. Awesome. Alright, well... We built this space elevator. We are now have a few more outposts and we are building our operation up, 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 up and out, 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 out. It's haphazard, but sometimes it sort of produces resources. Everyone, I want to thank you so much for watching. Check you next time. Take care.